recap of Astronaut Reserve Training Block 2, Week 3. It has been a really long week this week. It's actually Sunday. We've had the full week of training because a lot of things have been happening. It started off with the, the ceremony for our Astronaut Reserve Training Patch. Um, you can see that it's it's quite a colourful patch, but it represents where we train, so Cologne at the European Astronaut Centre, and the destinations that one day we will hope to go. There's the International Space Station, but then there are concepts of other future, future commercial space stations as well. This week coincided with the program board of Cuban and Robotic Exploration. So we had delegations from around Europe and they got to see the ceremony as well. And in my case, it's my colleagues from the UK Space Agency. So it's always nice to have a chance to hang out with them. We also continued with our aerospace engineering. So we had concepts of uh, aerodynamics. We had, uh, we learned about communications from space. We also learned about ideas of future interstellar travel and how that could or could not happen maybe one day in the future. We've had a series of exercise sessions, we've been swimming in the neutral buoyancy facility and then of course here we are in Rostock for the sea survival training. Uh, it's been an intense couple of days. Yesterday we did uh, the actual sea survival part. We had some theory in the morning and then in the afternoon we were dressed up in dry suits uh, and we were, went out in life rafts like this one. This is just a six person life raft. We were in a 12 person life raft. So we got to know what, what you need to do in the case um, of having to go out on a, on a life raft if something's happened to your ship. I mean, the, the relevance for us is that maybe a capsule might splash down somewhere unexpected and so it might take rescue services a little while to get to you and so in that time you have to know how to deal with the situation and so it was learning about techniques like that today we had fire awareness training so we were putting out fires with both fire hoses and fire extinguishers as well and we also had an exercise where we had to escape um, with a casualty through a, a burning building so there was smoke it was dark uh, there was a there were a lot of op obstacles to overcome go through holes through tubes that kind of thing uh, so it you know it's a serious situation but it was also quite a lot of fun to to do that training so looking forward to what's coming up next week <laughs>